Emotions in an East Texas courtroom today. Allegations of a jilted ex-boyfriend, a crime of passion, and manipulation to commit murder. Prosecutors are trying to prove Kendall Damal Johnson of Tyler manipulated a friend to fatally stab Lashikia Kenny in September of 2021, a woman he once dated. KLTV's Bob Hallmark was in the courtroom as the prosecution continued its case. The jury saw police interview video today. In it, Kendall Johnson was seen several times not telling the truth to investigators after the killing. In court, Johnson sat appearing unaffected and stoic. And you brought me three times in this room. At least three times. He had a very inconsistent story. His favorite word was compliant. I'm compliant. He said he was in Henderson, then he said he was in Kilgore. Though his friend, Calvin Anderson, had admitted to killing Johnson's ex-girlfriend, Lashikia Kenny, the prosecution was attempting to show Johnson had offered compensation and manipulated his friend into the murder. The $10,000, the cars, the car and financial stability yeah. for mm -hmm. his business. A forensic expert testified that Kenny suffered 17 wounds with a sharp-edged instrument, the major one slicing her jugular vein. Her right jugular vein, which is a large blood vessel that drains uh, blood from the head. The ultimate mechanism of death, you know, why somebody dies if they um, are assaulted with an edged weapon, is going to be blood loss. But it was Johnson's reaction to being questioned that caught the attention of Kenny's family and friends. Why? 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 Yeah, and he's like, oh, I'm nervous. Yeah, it's surprised surprised when they, they had to tell him what was going on. True. Nowhere during the interview did Johnson ask why. And I've been praying that they will take everything into consideration um, and that justice will be served for my best friend. Bob Holmark, KLTV 7 News. Calvin Anderson of Henderson pleaded guilty to Kenny's murder in January. He will not be sentenced until a verdict is reached in the Johnson trial.